saved from a cold, misty English Channel. Another group of migrants helped onto the beach at Dungeness today. Around 40 people rescued after the Coast Guard responded to a Mayday call. Amongst them, women and children, adding to an influx of almost 25,000 who've already arrived this year. I think next year you could be looking at over 100,000. I have been saying for a year that we have to make the UK less attractive. Therefore, an off-seas reception centre, I think, is really the only answer. Despite deals with the French, pictures filmed by ITV News this week show the migrants still cramming onto boats, leaving the Home Secretary searching for an alternative deterrent. She's understood to be interested in building secure migrant centres like those in Greece to deal with the thousands making this crossing. The Greek model, as it says, um, is not on its face a good model to follow, given that we know that there have been huge delays for many years for people trying to either get into the Greek asylum system or get decisions out of that system. But their steps into a new country are not universally welcomed. With the number of migrants arriving here at Dover and along the south coast still rising, the Prime Minister is said to be exasperated. He's demanding that all government departments concentrate on bringing these channel crossings to an end. Today, the reward of reaching British beaches clearly outweighed the risks, resulting in a seemingly endless stream of migrants. Juliet Bremner, ITV News, Dover.